Well, now to something many of you have probably noticed. Gas prices on the rise again. AAA says they are the highest we've seen in the past month. And with the start of the summer travel season just weeks away, there are concerns the increased costs will only get worse. Mark Lehman is following the latest live for us this morning. Mark, prices at the pump are causing a political showdown. Democrats are taking aim at oil companies while Republicans are calling out the president. It comes as there are continued concerns over the war in Ukraine and global supply. All this meaning drivers are paying more at the pump. As the roller coaster ride of gas prices continues, the cost of fuel is once again on the rise. AAA releasing the latest numbers overnight, showing the average price in Florida at 4.18 a gallon. That's an eight cent jump from last week and a dollar 40 more than this time last year. The question is the duration of the war. I mean, we had a market, an oil market that was already fairly tight in terms of supply and demand at the start of the year. Energy analysts say there are several factors driving gas prices up, including Russia's invasion of Ukraine. With the cost to fill up nearly $20 more compared to last year, Democrats are pushing a bill that would give the Federal Trade Commission the power to investigate the way energy companies set prices. Big oil companies are using both these issues, price gouging, market manipulation to cash in. Republicans, however, are continuing to place the blame on the Biden administration. The American people know it's not price gouging, nor is it Putin's price hike. It's Biden's price hike, and it started on day one. Some lawmakers have said they're open to the idea of a federal uh, gas tax holiday, but there are also concerns that could prompt oil companies to raise prices even higher. Now, uh, oil prices, meanwhile, are expected to remain uh, very volatile as we head into the summer travel season. For now, reporting live in Orange County, Mark Lehman, getting results, News 6.